Whoever said that the third time's the charm must not have met the students from the T.G. Glover Primary School who won their fourth consecutive title in the recently held Lego Lego League tournament on the weekend. C.S. Adelaide tells us tonight their eyes are now set on a regional win. A group of students from the T.G. Glover Professional Development and Research School were on a mission. In fact, several missions as they competed in the first Lego League tournament over the weekend. The robot has to carry the water, turn, put the water inside the fountain so this new shoot right here, a pop-up. It has to come up to base and then we get points for that. And they came out of that with a win. This victory marks the fourth for TG Glover. The 2017-2018 season was all about water, how to find, transport, use, or dispose of it, exploring hydrodynamics. The kids had to do research on a project. They had to then come up with a problem dealing with the theme for this year, which is hydrodynamics, and then they had to come up with a solution. That hard work has paid off for these 5th and 6th grade students beating out four other schools. And their principal, Jenny Hutchinson, says she's proud of them and touts the program for the invaluable lessons it has taught them. We found that our children, not only are they um, learning these um, technical skills, uh, like coding for example, which is really going to be the, the skill of the future, um, but also we find that um, the whole Lego League program develops the students' character as well. Now they're hoping for that winning streak to continue as the team of eight has qualified to compete regionally next week in the Dominican Republic. But they need your help to get them there. We're thinking about $1,000 per person and we have an eight team eight person team and we have three coaches. Well it's very important for us as a nation and as a community to invest in our kids. Siaska Adderley, ZNS Network News.